riding with our buddies Moto Discovery here in Arizona and we're gonna go find the coolest 72 hour loop we can find. In the morning we're going to Young for fuel and then kind of keep going and make our way probably to Sedona. I'm really looking forward to the scenery and that same sort of rocky uh, terrain. There's good camping up there. That's why it will be at probably 5,000 feet. So it won't get super cold. Michael said that it was 21 degrees. Right, see where we make it. Let's do it. How many inches are we going? We're going about seven inches yeah. in total. So, fuel up. Uh, beer can. Got a nice little spot for it right in my uh, R80 nook there. See what other kind of uh, trashy treasures we can find today. Wrap it in, wrap it out. goes. Did you hit your head? Oh yeah. Oh, the brand new fender. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Put that on yesterday. No way. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> At least if I could have a little blood, made for better TV. Day one. Day one. End of day one. Long day, fun day. Everybody's just kind of setting up their tents. Yeah. Lots of mud, Arizona mud. I don't know, I've never been to Arizona before. First time seeing a cactus, it looks exactly like uh, all the cartoons uh, depicted it. Which I've seen pictures of cactuses, but like the cartoons were more accurate in my opinion. Added some uh, cosmetic flair to the bike here. And everything's uh, mostly fine. Just high sided on a washout and whatever, you know. Sometimes you suck. You want to uh, experience something better than sex? The dry boot? No. A cucumber face wipe. Oh. Trust me, you want to do this, dude. Oh, yeah. Is it a makeup remover? Yes. Does it feel amazing? Yes. This is like log cabin meets bird nest. That match is not gonna last. Ooh, that thing is burning fast. I think, I think you might get it, it dropped. All right. wait, wait, wait for it, wait for it. Go to the cycle of shrubby stuff. I think what we should do is see how the morning goes, get through Payson, get through Pine and Strawberry, and then make our way towards Sedona, and then make the decision point on time. Either go north into Sedona, or skip it and start heading kind of south. Michael said that it was 21 degrees, or that's what the Tenere said. Um, I can't hold the camera. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know, you guys are all like freezing. I've got my battery pack for my ectotherm. I always say it's not that bad. <laughs> this is a flexible side water bottle. <laughs> getting used to my toes again. Day deuce. Here or here, <clears throat> you know this is the this is the ridge here. You heard it coming from Alex. Dugas, gonna be warm. <laughs> Warmer. <laughs> Did you get chocolate milk, Alex? Uh, from Wisconsin. That's where the good pickles come from. Is that true? Yeah. The name for it. Drink okay. a little first. 
Oh, that actually hit the spot. One to ten dust level. Mm, Twelve that was dusty. Behind Alex. What's the elevation there? What'd you say? Take? Kim Ferdy, it's maybe maybe five. Okay. Forty five hundred. Yeah. I'll shoot I'll shoot wheelie shots there. It's not an ADV ride unless you're setting up your tent in the dark. Take us a minute. Oh, there you are. <clears throat> Sometimes it sucks trying to find a camp spot, but it's also a rite of passage. You gotta, you gotta put a little effort in and it's worth it. You got the view. Oh, you like this? Yeah. I mean, I guess it's okay. It's your, your sort of thing. <laughs> wait, wow. wait, 770 oh per serving? Yeah, 770 milligrams, which is 33% of your really? daily value. And there's, if I'm reading that like right, that's six servings right? in that can. Like, what is it made of? Are you going to be able to turn it does it without it, like, falling in pieces? <laughs> <laughs> and I don't see any possible way to, like, spin that or flip that well. <laughs> I don't know where I saw that. Is you can have the end one if you want. Oh, really I mean, no, what, what, do you, what do you take, prefer? Right, yeah. Take that one. Oof, the end piece. Oh, it has a, a nice crisp texture to it. Yeah. Oh yeah. It's, all, it's, all, it's, all, it's a lot. That's fantastic. It's like three days of challenge. Oh whoa, what? <laughs> oh whoa. It's like creamy on the inside. Just grab it. Shouldn't be too hot. Like the spam house. See, yeah. Okay. It's salt. It's salty. I need, I need to take a photo of this. This is too good. The, the, uh, it's got a funk about it that I don't particularly love. Pop tart? No. Silly bean? Yeah. Oh, it's good. Yeah. It's not nearly as cold this morning. But this pop tart's rad. It was much better. Yeah. I even had some crazy dreams last night, so. Yeah. Those are fun. Gotta know you slept a little bit. <laughs> Day three. ADB weekend. Uh, well, this is the 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 final. Uh, I f***ed it up. Yesterday was uh, another long day rolling into camp uh, in the the late evening. Uh, we had some just fantastic charbroil spam last night um, that I can't speak fondly of enough. You threw yours into the woods for some reason. We're gonna do some cool stuff today. Wrap it up. End back up in Phoenix. It's gonna be rad. Just make it a little bit safer. Let me get you that one more pipe, okay? Okay. Breakfast burrito, coffee. Mm. That sounds like a well, butthole disaster stuff. later. Nope. Nope. <laughs> Going to a hotel room tonight. <laughs> so right now we're in Camp Verde. Talking about some options, our destination is Apache Junction here. Basically, we need to get to the start of Bloody Basin Road, which is right here.
Today was super cool. We got to hit some sections of Arizona coming out of Camp Verde that I've never ridden before. And uh, a lot of this route I've done and it's such a cool example of what you can find in this state. It's just great to share this great state with all these guys. I'm having a blast. Uh, just one day after another, uh, Arizona is completely surprising. Yeah, you think it's all cactus and you know, desert two track, but then you get into the hills and the pine forest and the, the loamy flowy two track up high. And it's just, uh, it's just surprising at the, the amount of different kind of terrain you, you find here. So it's this tree. That's a great tree, man. Uh, what do you think? Ah, oh, it's, it's been an awesome three days. Really coming from never having seen Arizona or spent time here to like putting two wheels down through cactus, through mud, through snow, and then finding some fun hill climbs and almost washing out some corners and some sand. It's been a fun time. Definitely ready though, after three days, the, the back's feeling it and ready for some ice cream and, and a nice hot tub. Day three was a bloody good time in Bloody Basin. It was good, I'm a little bit tired. I think 72 hours is a great length for a trip. I think we've done a little bit over 400 miles in uh, you know two and a half days, and the the switchbacks coming down Bloody Basin were definitely the highlight today. Yeah, Arizona's sweet. I've never been here. One of the few states I've never really been this far south to ride. I didn't know what to expect. I expected like just honestly like Utah desert, but the cacti were sweet. I was really surprised by all the trees and like the greenery. It's actually pretty green here. Um, I went down obviously day one. My neck is pretty stiff, so I'm like real glad it's only a three day trip. Uh, I'm ready for ice cream, ready for hot tub, and uh, ready to do the next one. <laughs>